Hi guys, Nick Miller today from Work Supply Company. Sorry, I'm a little different attire today. It is cold here in Pennsylvania. It's about 27 this morning here. Um, we're gonna get a couple videos in. And uh, we have a 2016 Kubota uh, RTV X900 here with a uh, OEM Kubota dealer installed steel cab and heat. Uh, you're looking at as the way this thing sets about $21,000 from Kubota in the 900 with the steel cab. There's a very, very nice cab, uh, very nice shape. This unit has just 153 hours and there's 994 miles. It's four wheel drive, hydrostat, uh, very nice cart. Purpose of this video today is we're going to start running this cart. Should it do anything it's supposed to do? We'll start you right here underneath the engine compartment. So, unit is powered by a Kubota D902 three-cylinder diesel engine. Starts and runs great. There's no abnormal noise, smoke, blow by, anything like that whatsoever. Uh, unit is very clean. Uh, it had uh, basically had a full service done at, a, at uh, 74 hours, and it's not due for another 100 hours. But everything is clean. We checked everything out. Um, not in any of the no salt or anything like that this thing is extremely extremely clean so look inside the bed here has the factory sprayed in liner um gentleman did have a little wood rack with it um that, that we did take off and everything going around here we'll show you inside the cab is very clean which it should be does have the storage compartment for the seat, adjustable driver's seat, 153 hours and we're to start it, 994 on miles, uh, cab heat air all, or cab heat all work, there is no air on these. Underneath the hood, overflow radiator, everything's there like that, everything there is good and clean the way it should be. Guy did have a little toolbox on the front, mounted on a receiver hitch. We left it all there because it just kind of looked pretty nice, and guy did a nice job. Front windshield does tip out, does have windshield wiper, has LED lights on the roof, four-way package. I'm gonna go ahead and fire thing up, run around, show you guys. Starts, runs, works just the way it's supposed to. We had a guy come Saturday to buy a utility vehicle and he was all concerned. How do I test the four wheel drive? That's how I show people. Put it in reverse, back up as hard as you can. The rear tires will spin, put a four wheel drive. Nothing's going to spin because all four wheels are biting. So, uh, if you're looking for an excellent utility vehicle, here is something to look at 2016, 153 hours, very nice, very clean, steel cab with heat. Uh, these are the workhorse of the utility vehicle lineup out there today. If you want something to go 55 mile an hour, this is not for you. Shut the video off right now. There's no sense in listening anymore of me. 
Uh, but at the end of the day, if you want something that's a work vehicle, you can haul hay in it, you can haul dirt in it, you can go out working on the side of the mountain and it holds back. It'll actually hold back coming down the mountain. Here's something to look at. It actually has a real hydrostatic transmission on it. Uh, these are a tough cart. I have one. I actually have several of these, three of them. They're a great utility vehicle. So if you have any questions, 814-658-3066. Uh, you're welcome to come by, check it out, run it for yourself. I have nothing to hide. Again, 814-658-3066 as always. Thank you very much for checking out Work Supply Company. Have a great day.